which metabolizes plastics. And uh, this is because uh, it's not, so one bacteria couldn't do all that all this because plastics are very very complicated molecules and they're very big and, and uh, quite diverse if we look at how many plastics we actually use in our day-to-day -day lives. This is how it's going to look like in two weeks. In seven weeks time it goes to this, the sludge, which is the end product of our process. A very very important note is that in our case bioplastics aren't a contaminant either because our bacteria can very, very easily biodegrade the LA as well. If it works on a large scale, it can make a global impact because the problem with plastics up until now was that they lingered on in the environment forever. But once we can biodegrade them, bring them back into the natural environment, they become part of nature again, become part of the global recycling system, not just the human life.